Yo guys, what is up? This is Dean Marino one here. I guess we're putting this show on YouTube. Uh, I'm here with my boy, Grandpa Jay, Grandpa Jack. Uh, we're snowboarding right now. We're on the chairlift, and we thought, what better time to do a commentary than on the very safe haven place of a chairlift? So, Jack, how are you feeling today, man? Feeling what were we just doing? Oh, we're going nuts right now. We just ripped a few bowls. We're going down, hitting some jumps, you know, some crazy shit. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Dino Marino over here. Oh, he's Dino. a champ. He's a champ. No, no, he's no. I, everything. I, I give it all, to Grandpa J. Expect some inverted yeah. corks very soon oh. from him. I wouldn't say I would be doing any corks anytime soon without breaking my neck, <laughs> but I say Grandpa Jack is a lot better than I am. But I was thinking last night, and I was thinking really hard about an afterlife. An afterlife. All right. Where'd so you go? Well, there are, like, many different theories as to where you're going to go, as you may know, like, Buddhism, like, reincarnation, you know, heaven or hell. There's no really, like, clear-cut answer to our, like, overall problem. But, I mean, I just feel like whatever you believe in is what's going to happen to you. You know, if you believe you're going to be reincarnated, you're going to come out as a fucking beautiful-ass butterfly flying the airs with no worries in the world. Or, like, if you're, like, atheist or agnostic or whatever, you don't... You're just gonna burn there. You're gonna rot. You're gonna do whatever. You're either gonna be in that kiln or you're gonna be underground. And it's just you, you die there, you know. You've given me that theory before, and that is absolutely one of the best theories I've heard. <laughs> Fucking just coming back as another person. Like maybe I could have been like a knight in shining armor last week. Dude, um, knight Jack. Knight in shining armor. Yeah, dude, I, I must have been a grandpa in my former. Oh life. my yeah. god! Ever since that one day yeah. at Big Easy's house, I just yeah. I, well, that's a story for another yeah, chairlift. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, it just makes a lot of sense, you know. Like, who's to say that one religion is any different than the other? But maybe, like, it, like this life that we made is based upon the fact that God or whoever the fuck is out there wants us to choose something and not have no faith at all. Because if you live life without faith, then you're kind of living in the shadow of whatever life could be after this. Unless you believe that the Big Bang theory was oh, like what happened. Before the Big Bang Theory. Big, the Big Bang? Oh, you gotta believe it's the, the Big Bang. <laughs> the, <laughs> the Big, big Bang! bang. Oh, yeah, like I have so Big Bangs every night. Hi- yeah, you do. <laughs> Fucking, or did a higher being create this world in six days and just like, alright, go. Just go, have fun. Like, like, Or is it possibly a combination? Like a god created the Big Bang and this, this oh, world came out? Oh, like, I never thought of that. Like the correlation? But then it, if God could create a Big Bang like here, he could have Big Bangs like... Dude, Mil- millions or there could be tons of other earths but like how do you judge time from god like if god's making other oh. universes how can you judge time like how can we even tell that like a plant how far can we we just made up our, we just made up all our own measurements so like we, we made up measurements so we like somebody else can measure something completely different do you like it's yeah, because yeah, like, it, I mean, it I can't know. be down to the very, like, mile, you know, like, <laughs> no, right, no <laughs> or, or, like, light year, for that matter, because they're so far away yeah, from dude, each like, other. The closest uh, planet that they could see that might be able to sustain Earth is, like, 13 light years away. Yeah, like, we're not getting there anytime soon. Like, that's a far-ass <laughs> way, dude. What was that, like, and, like, 400 years or something? And, like, that's just how far we can see with the telescope. Yeah, like, exactly. We have no idea what's beyond that, because we can't see that far. Exa- and, like, even if we get to that planet, we're probably not gonna see anything beyond that either because everything is just spaced out so like yeah. fully and, and like, h- how do we know about black holes if we've never seen one do you believe in aliens no oh dude i think there has to be aliens uh, but like, not not like aliens like i believe in other life forms yeah, but like, like not like green-headed like no 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 but if i like come into earth by alien means i mean like <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> by I, alien means. aliens i mean just like any other sort of like they could be just humans on another yeah, yeah no i still be aliens, I, of course you know? dude like think about how many planets are out there and just because we can't study that there's no clear-cut evidence that we like are ever going to see any other human beings or anything else that's alive for that matter outside of this world but we're going to definitely do it because there has to be something out well, there. There's people that they say they see UFOs, right? Yeah. If we've seen UFOs and if any of this were real, that means that there are aliens out there that are more technologically advanced because they found us and we didn't find them. Right, dude? So it's definitely possible. I or, think there could be aliens. Or like, I wouldn't deny it. Or, or what if like this this galaxy is part of a computer simulation? Oh, and, and like at the end of this galaxy, like a black hole is just like the termination of the system. Make a TV show. Make a TV show. <laughs> Make a TV show like that. I don't know. But we're getting off the chairlift right now. I'm gonna fall on my face if I keep talking on the phone and doing this shit. So once again, we're gonna be making a lot more of these. It's the chairlift commentary with Grandpa Jack and Grandma Nizio. Take it easy. Take it easy, you guys. Dean Marina one here logging out.